Hey guys, how's it going? Welcome back. Well, Perlator, of course, has come today. And one of the things I got was a KNF Concept tripod for my DSLR camera. I looked at a lot of different tripods, and this one does some really freaky stuff. Um, you can even take it all apart and use it as a single stick or flip your whole camera upside down underneath and do some weird spreading with the legs. It's freaky. Anyway, so for 120 bucks, I figured, you know, why not uh, give it a go? I mean, I've we've got a lot of tripods around here, but they're all cheaper tripods, and um, some of them actually kind of really suck. But, hey, it's a tripod. It kind of does the job, but we want better quality. And as many of you know by now, my wife has a DSLR camera now, too, and uh, so we each have one. So let's take a look at what we got in here. We got a nice carry bag, which is really cool. Got a nice shoulder strap there. Um, yeah, that's some of that stuff we can throw away now. That's pretty cool. That's a nice quality bag. All right. So, let's see what we got. Well, this is a whole lot of wicked. Is it actually? Yeah, it's, it's actually. That's neat. Wow. Okay, so we're definitely going to have to. Uh... All right, so let's just unscrews. And we'll slap that up like that. That's, that's pretty tall. And that's just sitting there. And uh, so we can just ratchet the uh, legs. Like I said, you can do some really weird stuff with this thing. It's, um, you know what? I'm going to change the camera around so we can get a better floor shot of this thing. So just bear with me a second. It'll be instant for you guys. Okay, so we've uh, made a little bit of space in here anyhow. So uh, let's extend the legs out. So, other than the, the clamps to hold the legs steady, and a bit of foam here, because this is going to be your steady stick, um, it's just, uh, it, it's all metal. And this thing can go quite tall too, which is like really amazing. Wow! Okay, we do not have enough backspace to put this in frame properly. However, if you're on uneven terrain, this can definitely come in handy um, to do some pretty wicked setup. Like, that's just one of the angles. It's kind of like a lopsided pyramid. But, um, holy cow. It definitely, uh, oh, so we, we just do this. So we unscrew this part, and then this becomes our new steady shot stick. So that's the only leg that actually unscrews for that, obviously. And then you can screw your camera into there, and away you go. Um, let's see if we can get some sort of balance to this here. Okay, I've got. Two notches there, two there. Two notches there. So they lock in really good. It's, and like I said, it's all metal. Um, these collars are plastic. Um, we got plastic locks. Um, this piece here at the bottom, it uh, works as a hanger, but it's also supposed to uh, come out so that we can flip the camera upside down underneath it. I'm just trying to, uh, there we go. So we unscrew this. This is kind of really cool stuff. So we'll take that, put that away for a second. We do this. Oh, look at that. And that can go under like that. And then we just can screw the piece back on the top. 
Um, I know it's it's you you can't really see this in frame. I'm so sorry that I don't have a lens that gives me a wide tie of my angle. Let's see if we can bring the height up here a bit. This is crazy stuff, guys. All right. Wow, that helps. So I've got it upside down. So once you get that all done, you just put the cap back here, screw this back in place, you know, so that it's it's on there properly. And of course, this can work as a hanger system. Um, and then your your camera's down under, so then you can do some freaky stuff with the legs like this and some other weird angle stuff to get any kind of shot you can think of. <laughs> it's just that that's that's crazy. You know that that's really neat. So anyways, so it is a it is a neat tripod system. Um, for 120 bucks on Amazon, it's kind of like for all this thing can do, it's like why not? You know, like how do you say no to something? I mean, look at this, like you can go right up and it's like, I would never reach the camera. It's so tall, but then I could shorten my legs and you know, do that sort of thing. And holy cow, I mean, that almost hits my ceiling. Jeez, that's nuts. Anyway, wow, that's, it's a wow factor, guys. Um, no review at this time. I want to get some infield use with this thing. So, you know, I mean, we're still in winter right now. And uh, I kind of love my DSLR camera. And I don't know how well they do out in the cold. So I'm going to wait till the milder day. And then I'll uh, take this thing for a spin outside. Um, you know, maybe a few times and see how it does that way. Now, as far as the rest of this goes, um, you know, we've got this, this clamp system. Uh, so we can clamp it right in place, you know, and you can even slide it back further if you need to or push it more forward. Uh, we also have a level here too so that we can see the level and make sure everything's like perfectly leveled. Um, the release is here. Now this is a ball system, which is kind of really neat um, because you can, you know, change angles like really weird even in here, you know. Um, get your, yourself in position to, to lock up where you need it. Um, it's just, it's really cool. That's like a really amazing piece of kit. So why is this? Oh, I guess that has to uh, go tight there. There we go. Ah, smoother. So that had to be tightened up I should actually uh... so this thing can be disassembled quite quite a fair fair piece so there you go you can swivel there you can have your camera down on an angle clamp that back up you know that that's so if you wanted to even do some kind of panoramic thing just unlock it and then just slowly turn this yourself kind of thing and that'd be really freaky we're gonna we're gonna definitely shoot some neat videos with this tripod you can count on it so that is so so neat now the leg that screws off of course you know it's it's here and you can screw your camera into it actually you know what i've got my camcorder here so let me just lean this against here now okay I see we're gonna have to unscrew the head as well that's why the head was this spot yeah okay so let's lean that up against there so it doesn't go anywhere on us so then we screw this in like so a couple of turns and you've got your steady stick 
which you can still use all the same features here you know with your with your ball for getting your directions all that sort of jazz so this is going to come in really handy because i want to do some um not just night video uh but night photography as well um in which case my other gizmos that i have will come in handy for that sort of stuff as well <coughs> but um i think this is definitely worth a good look at um my wife and i were both watching the video on this and it's like that is so sick there was a similar one to this as well but um in looking at the build quality difference um it's like well you know what for you know an extra couple of bucks we're definitely going to be getting a far superior one over the last the other one that we saw so that's a really important thing to have a quality built product and this can can rotate as well you know because it's being held under pressure uh, from the locking collar so and it's, a, it's anodized aluminum and just tighten that up to where you want it so even if you want this all the way down you can just work with the one shaft you know but if you need even more height you've got the two of them you know it's like voila and it's like hi it's way up here literally this thing is way taller than i am so anyways uh let me know what you guys think in the comments below <coughs> um i'm just waiting for some other stuff to uh get charged up and whatnot um and uh we'll go from there but I'll, I'll come back with another video at some point uh either today tonight or tomorrow we'll have the dslr set up on this with all of its little glory toys um so you can see exactly how it's going to look with an actual camera on here um but uh, otherwise i mean we could easily just put the camcorder on here but it would look kind of stupid but <laughs> you know what why not so there are some people that would buy something like this even if all they have had was a camcorder you know and it's just as simple as you know twister in place you know feed her in let's uh there we go so you can lock that down that sort of thing i will set up the dslr on this don't worry um it'll look way better with the dslr attached so anyway um i i'm seeing that so far my first impression so this is not a review so you know please don't say thanks for the review um it's not a review um <laughs> i always title the word review in my videos when i do a review um, this is just, you know, first impressions, what I think. Um, I'm going to read the book to find out about the scale markers on the side here, what that exactly is about. Um, but, uh, I mean, this thing's even taller than me, just at this height. It's kind of like, man, I should lower this a little. <laughs> I need to still grow up a little bit, but I don't want to. Anyway, um, so that's all I got for you for this one. So, uh, like I said, stay tuned for more. Uh, we'll have some more on this, uh, definitely. Um, I'm looking forward to getting some use out of this and doing some really cool videos um, with this tripod. Um, I'm, I'm like, I'm so stoked. I'm like, man, this thing is so, this thing's so flipping cool. It's like, okay, so we got, what is this? Okay, so we got two holes here for something. Well, it's not for the bracket. It's definitely not for that. Um, anyways, and we do have an Allen key as well. So if we need to snug stuff up over time, um, we do have an Allen key that was supplied to us with this thing. So that's not a problem. I'll go through the manual more so that when I do do the review, I'll know everything there is to know about it. But I thought I'd show you a few things about it anyway that i did know so that's quite cool anyways thank you so much guys for watching uh stay tuned for more i've got more videos today of some uh camera stuff i've got a lot more stuff coming from amazon over the next little while as well plus i'm about to make another order in the next couple minutes anyways see ya